Oh, this angle is so bad. I can't tell if I'm behind the, the tractor or not. No, uh, bro, we don't have time for that. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, that shit didn't work. Oh, my God. I chose the wrong weapon. Kenny! And this dude is gaining on me. It's a good day to have a good day. I don't know what the fuck I was about to say. Anyways, sexy was good. Welcome back to another video. We are back with some more of The Walking Dead. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. We back. That's all I gotta say. Make sure y'all hitting that like button. Let's get into this. Hey, right, real quick, real quick, real quick. Um, let me know in the comments below. Is is Michonne needed? Like, do you need to play Michonne in order to like you know, get everything. Don't be, and don't be one of them guys that's like, yeah, no, you got to, you got to know, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if that shit's not for real important, don't make me play it. But all right, cool. Mocking Dead, episode two. Let's get it. The game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Love seeing that, man. Love seeing that. All right. <sighs> What's going on now, man? Do we get like a little time skip? Seems like we did, because it seems like it's like fall now. I didn't notice like this game like the background scenery is all like kind of meshed together with the colors and stuff. Oh shit! I feel like here. I gotta remember how to play. Damn it! What they? Who's this? this uh, looks like a rabbit. Yeah, this has to be a time skip. I don't know this dude. I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark. So he held us some help. Take it. Gotcha. We're all hungry. No kidding. Dude, honestly, I feel like that'd be like the worst part of like an apocalypse, just being hungry. My hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. You have to ask Illy, not enough. I'll just just say it one minute. Just keep them, you know what I'm saying? You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. But he knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. I don't give a yeah, fuck what Kenny got going on, bro. And and Lily fighting Honestly. Things are getting pretty tense back at the motor end. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking Try off if he up. can get that RV running. Low key, like, Kenny want to abandon this? He's got a family to look out for. He's better off without us. I think we're stronger. I don't as even a care, group. bro. I'm not saying I just nothing. don't know what'll happen if we start to break apart. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going? Well, I don't even there? know you. Like, what, what do you, you mean, stronger as a group? I don't know this dude. With you in particular. <laughs> <laughs> they better give us some sort of like backstory on him, because right now I don't give a fuck about what he got going on. He's just an old. Oh, you talking about old dude? He's old racist. That's his deal. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Hard problems are not. We should all be. I shouldn't have said that actually. And I know Lily thinks he's. Why did I say that? But the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. How the fuck do you know that? Who the fuck is out here just telling stories about me getting punched on? That is not important. He's new to the group. He doesn't even need to know that. <laughs> now nah, I'm not liking him already. I know I'm not tripping. He's new, right? Don't risk the noise. Can you Don't. make the shot? Gunshot will bring Don't risk the noise, bro. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Ah! Shit, was that oh, Kenny? Oh, well, that doesn't matter. Know. Come on. Either way, we got noise, bro. We should have ate. Fuck, I sold. <laughs> Man, who's screaming like that? That can't be Kenny. Or is it? No, that's not Kenny. Is it? Jesus no, Christ. Kenny. Oh, shit. Ooh. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Teacher? Get, get it off. Get it oh, off. There's Kenny. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided Ooh. our camp. And we barely got away from that. 
What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? We're not gonna hurt I don't you, know, man. The camp. What the Just hell what happened? happened? <laughs> Mr. Parker said we should stay off the streets. We were trying to be careful, but Please, fuck he ran into a bear right. trap. I know that is hurting, bro. Huh? My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We might have to cut his shit off, bro. Was he bitten? Bitten? No, uh, was I he swear. Bitten? Hurry, please, hurry. Oh, they're coming. Hey, hey, I don't. <laughs> look, bro. If we can't get him out, I'm out of here. I'm sorry. Shit. Walkers. There's no release slash. We got to cut his shit off. Please. Get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Yeah. Kenny, keep those walkers That's the only off way. of me. Oh, Jesus, those things are going to be here soon. Uh, bro, I'm not. Lee, do like, something. I don't remember how to. Okay. No, no, no. Stop. I'm trying. You do something. Fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Please. Try to cut Jane. Then I'm cutting your leg off. That's just it. I'm cutting your leg off. I'm cutting your leg off. I'm cutting your leg off. There's nothing else to happen. No, no, no. Try the trap Let's again. go. Let's Anything, go. Please. No, uh, bro, we don't have time for that. I'm sorry, bro. Executive decision. Ah! It has to be now. Executive decision. Executive decision. Oh, why are we zooming in on that? Oh, executive decision. I'm sorry. We have to go now. Last one, last one, last one. Fuck, we could have cut it lower, right? Shit. That shit is gross. He passed out. Can we carry it? Bro, that's a lot of blood loss, too. Grab him and let's go. At least he left them like a little snack or something, bro. A little ankle. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! Bro, what is this dude doing? Run! Nah, nah, nah. This dude wanted to die. No! Y'all, come on now. That what is this Travis dude doing? You have so much like open space and opportunity. You got a damn Letterman on. You know I ain't got no type of athletic abilities. So too starved for help. Ah, oh, this is gonna be about us not being able to eat. Oh, a little clum. Yeah, everybody just look miserable, bro. Gonna tell her to stop kicking the thing. Damn, they trained. Okay, so that means, hey, get your eyes Get down. the gates open. All we right. got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on. Come oh on. God. I already know what's about to happen. They're gonna be mad that we brought what you because we already ain't got enough food. I have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing Bro, can you stop here. screaming what my name? What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing behind. more mouths to feed life. was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. He would have died if we left him. He would have died. So what? We are not so responsible it. for yeah, every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. What's y'all take on something like this, bro? Like... Like, imagine there was an apocalypse and you do see somebody struggling. Like, is it really just like, hey, fuck humanity, every man for themselves? Or like, is it like, hey, we should try to stick together? Because I, I do think like people would lose their humanity in an uh, apocalypse and then it'd just be easy to just be like, oh, yeah, well, fuck everybody hang on. else. But we haven't even talked to I don't these know, people bro. yet. Maybe like they I'm can be person. helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you bro, have we don't even know enough you. for all of us. 
but that food is almost gone. We've got Dang. maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what- You might be getting kicked out. No, I- Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group? Hey, shut up, Clem, bro. Way to read the room. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on. You're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. But now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a mm. goddamn Nazi. You've got nothing to say I'm about that, Lee? I'm so sick of Kenny, bro. I know we just started this episode, but he's pissing me off, bro. Anytime I don't, like, automatically take his side, he want to say something. Bro, I didn't, like, I didn't take her side or nothing. Like, why do I have to be, like, on your side all the time, bro? You can't fight your own battles? God, he's so annoying, bro. You know, it might feel safe for you to by your sit silence, on the fence, bro. I don't give a but sooner or later, you're going to have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you Ooh, stepping on up her to side make the hard point. decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? This fucking dude. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Hey, I already know who's getting some. <laughs> you you saying like that's a hard choice. I'm going straight to Clem. I'm going straight to my mouth. And uh, yeah, after that, I don't know. Ten hungry people. Oh, you only have food or four food items for ten hungry people. Damn, so six people ain't eating. Yeah, y'all two not eating. I can tell you that right now. Um, I should go straight to the kids. I should give Duck some too, but uh, you know what I'm saying. Honestly, it might be uh, Lee, Lily, Clem, and Duck. That's what I'm leaning towards right now. Ah, uh, let's just talk to you, buddy. I don't. I'm not guaranteeing any food right now. Uh, sure. I'd better not. <laughs> Sure. Just throw him on her. Don't even help. Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this sewing up people's injuries. But I'm hold on, bro. Cuts Dude, and bruises better. are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. There we go. I like that. It's what your it's husband what your wanted. Let's blame fucking Kenny. Figures. I love that man to death, but I swear sometimes he's dumber than a bag of hammers. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need low a little key, space here anyway. Loki, I feel like she should get food too. Just because like she's like the medic of the group or something. But uh, I don't know, bro. This is this actually is a hard decision. It's not too hard because like I'm telling you, Clem and okay. and me are eating. Where's After that, head? that's where it I becomes don't know. hard. Can you help me find it? Sure. Uh, yeah. When did you Anything lose it? for you? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take Is care of that. Really some helping things. though? Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Wait, 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 wait! Before you go back to playing with Duck, take this little cheese and crackers. You already know you eating. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Half an apple, piece of jerky. Yeah, you get the cheese and crackers, right? Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck Come is hungry now. too. Yeah, why don't we need to get some food? <laughs> Alright, let me get Duck some food, bro. Let me... Uh, let me get half an apple, bro. You look like a fucking jerky type of dude, but... Can you like yeah. rather than why oh, he's pissing yes. me off? Is there peanut butter? <laughs> what do you think, uh, Doc? Good. No, probably not. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 
So we fed the kids. Um, the best thing to do would probably to not to be to not feed myself. Let's talk to Carly. I'm um, giving out food. What should I do? Let's we'll see what she says. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food. You know that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food. I, too. I gave Doug food we already. We need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Thanks, Carly. Hey, with that, with you saying that right now, all right there, that lets me know you're not getting food. Like, not in like a mean way, but like, that means that she would be okay with me giving food to other people. Sleeping any better? So I'm not no. going to give her food. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. Back in oh, the she's bed. thinking about like what happened at the drugstore. <clears throat> All right, so I hate to say this, y'all. Unfortunately, I might have to give Larry food, and so then that means there would be one more. So the kids ate, then Larry, and then that that last one is really like a wild card. I could give it to anybody. I would give it to uh, Lily, but I feel like she would rather me just give it to Larry. But yeah, I don't know. But Kenny, like that should get me it, uh, get me in good with Kenny. Not that I fucking care, but I gave him. Uh, his son some food so should be good words getting out that you want to leave the motor in that ain't no secret lee it's probably our best bet look you've been good to me and my family you saved duck from those monsters and you stood up to larry at the drugstore i won't forget that you and clem are welcome to come with us oh we already going i'll bet yeah no need to give him any more food you should stay here the coast does uh, sound Coast like does idea. sound like a smart idea. Say that. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Yeah, I mean, I told him it was a good idea because, like, staying doesn't seem like a good idea either because, like, at some point, we're going to run out of food. There's only so much food in this area. And then you just have to keep going further and further out. So I, I don't think fucking staying here is a good idea. Uh, let's give this fucking old man some goddamn food. Will you hold He's probably going to say give it to his daughter. Steady. One of them is going to say I'm trying. Well. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got mm. 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Damn. Oh, my God. <sighs> Let's give Larry some food. Here, Larry. Give him a jerky. Lily would want uh, you to a piece of jerky. Yeah. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Oh, man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Oh, look at this dude, bro. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Look at this dude. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. My mom said I could eat hot chips. Like, shut up, bro. Here, I'm Mark, giving it to Mark. Help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the He's the one who asked for it. Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. It's not Things that serious, different. bro. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you ah, think fuck. this is? Ah, oh, fuck. Is that what you told me? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's right. That's not what I meant. I never said that. I'm just not going to say anything. Whatever. I got work to do. Okay, cool. Sometimes staying silent be working, bro. That silent shit, yeah. Uh, keep the last piece of food for yourself. Save the last piece of food for someone else. Fuck I that. I'm sorry. I'm being too. selfish. The right thing to do would be to give it to someone else. I don't know anyone else. I gave it to each party that's in here, other than like the new people. The new people that's ain't such getting it. an nothing. easy job, so is I gave it? it to each party, and then, yeah. It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. Yes, sir. I'm serious. Yes, sir. I offer to come with All right, us. people recognize More him. than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. 
Like who? I really feel like I pleased everybody here. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Dang. Ken, come back. There's nothing- What are you mad for? I'm sick of this shit too. I'm sick of this shit too. <laughs> you don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. He kind of is. What do we do kid? with the body? Oh! Oh! Oh, what the f He was- They lied! They fucking lied! Lying ass! Bro, give me the fuck. Why would I give them the axe? I sold- What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Bang his head on the side! Bang his head on the side! Keep going, keep going! Keep going, right side, right side, right side! Give me the fucking axe, bro! You suck! Oh my god, you suck. I should've gave it to Larry. Bro, can you swing or something? Why is he just sitting there? Bro, this dude is so trash, bro. I don't even know his name. Bro, we had a whole axe and we had to waste a bullet because somebody just was trash. You okay? Yeah, thanks. I should have gave it to Larry, bro. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! That's he fucked wasn't! Up. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? Wait, what's he? Hold on. It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. What the hell it's type of apocalypse is this? How? We're all infected? Everyone? I, I guess so. I don't know. I, all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all Damn, hiding out really? in the gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Ah, oh, she was in there turning that motherfucker into a party. That's in fact. Oh, wait. Whoa, Who's lady, this? relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Saxon, yeah. Are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. The dead could be anywhere. But, Who's uh, there on us? I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Why do you Our generators like run on gas. <laughs> Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If Y'all be willing to lower your a guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Dairy farm, yeah, they do, they, yeah. Dairy Wait, cows and why shit. Why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Yeah, let's do it. No deal, we'll just stay here. No, 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 we gotta go. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy in exchange you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for see, a while. See, but like, shit like this in the apocalypse, like, you never know, man. You really never know. Like, ah. Uh, it's hard to know if you can trust somebody or not. So, this dairy. You guys the really niggas is hungry, food? man. Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Okay, bet. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Oh, really? Say that. Me as a leader? You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. 
Does anyone else know? Yeah, fucking Larry. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? Our. But I want to know the same thing. Now's not the time. You know what happened. You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I appreciate I that. I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Nah, I agree with her Maybe though. Like, why does that matter Listen, anymore? Over the it's years, a whole different world now. Some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. Why fuck with her heavy? Uh, Hold on. I really appreciate that. I should have gave her food. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I don't know why. They just don't look like... Motor Inn's my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? You can say that again. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that Motor Inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Y'all asking a lot of questions. Kenny, Lily, it's a democracy. We work as a group. Yeah. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. See, and then like every time I they ask one of these like really prying questions, and then it says that they took note of it, it lets me like know like they up uh, to something, bro. Because why are you taking note of the fact that hmm, okay, it's a democracy over there? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And how long y'all been there? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like I don't, I don't know, bro. Just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Look at them. Change the subject. Well, the kid here is our newest arrival, but we're all looking forward to some food. Yeah, like they, nah, bro, they, nah, they well, trying to get here's a to scout report. Each other out. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy yeah. for as long as I can remember, but. I'm now telling y'all, bro, I'm, yo, I'm locked in. I am so locked in. I, I've been telling y'all, bro, Scoot, uh, what do we call it, Scootopia and all that. I'm locked in. When it comes to this, like, apocalypse shit, ain't nobody going to catch me lacking, bro. You asking all these prying questions, I'm ready for it. Put me out of this. Wait, huh? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of oh, anything. Shit. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Don't think who? haven't noticed. Those look like the people who Calm raided down. my Your camp. Paranoia is pissing everyone who are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and you guys were keeping it There's all for yourself. Oh no, there's yeah, and you know what? More. We ate oh, it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Oh shit! Oh! Double tap! Yep. Fuck you! Oh my god! Fuck you! Oh my Jesus. god! Asshole! He did that nigga dirty. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. You're not gonna go like search that dude though? He had a whole crossbow. I kind of want that. Hey, Y'all tripping, bro? I would have went and searched him. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The French keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with Ooh. generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yeah, that's the same thing I was thinking. I don't know volts, but it just sounded like a lot the way he was saying it. Ever have any accidents? What kind of question? Can't have kids around the fence. A brilliant setup. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. That's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's been living down at the old motel, round the way. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh, he oh looks my sick. goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Nothing's in the control. We work together. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of. I wonder if I would have said something else. He probably would have been like, "But you told well, me this." That's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place.
Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that apply for the rest of us? Does that offer apply to the rest of us? Yeah, We're all back. incredibly hungry. Yeah. Things are for y'all. Bake fresh this morning. Amazing. Ooh, we some biscuits. I can't get stuff like that Boy. anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Ah, oh, she's sick. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Damn, can oh, you, like, back up and oh, let me oh, I handle it? have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Oh, hell yeah. That's It'd a deal. It'd be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? No, nah, that's a deal. Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take okay, this. like he was just trying to be... Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. All right, bet we got biscuits. Mark, Lee, why don't you? And take we a about look to get around. a feast. Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. All right, you betcha. Can do this that. place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Well, let's make sure the place is safe. We should do whatever we can to help out. Let's make sure it's Before safe. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. But Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Bro, are you fucking maybe, serious? Maybe there's other things not working that we just. It's a fucking see. swing. And check at least I got a swing. Perimeter. Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. No, nah, but what I was right. gonna say is, I'll at the end of the day, it doesn't matter, bro. This is safer than the the motel. So. It's open, and you find out what you can from Andy. All right. So you said what? Walk the perimeter. And he just gonna sit here. I wish there was like a sprint button. If a couple of tools out of the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Mm -hmm. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. It really might be safe out here. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. All right, let's talk to dude. See what he needs help with. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? No one fucks with us. We can help protect your dairy. You can help protect the dairy. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Uh, are we your first? Yeah, let's ask for the first guest. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. All right. Um, yeah, let's Mark go and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. Fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds That's easy enough. You got it. Stay attentive. You never know. Doing all this for a free meal? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. 
Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he yeah, was Yeah, why? Yeah, let's talk about that. tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just, it popped out. What's up with this dude, bro? He's a piece of shit while working out. Uh, I try to be civil. I try to be here. civil, at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. So this dude just randomly popped up at our fucking place because he had food. Ugh. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just letting y'all know right now. If it comes to a decision Wait, to like let him dead. die or something, I don't know why I would, on, but if it does, it I'm letting him die because I don't know this dude. Why would I take the arrow out? Disgusting. Just in case, like we need it or something. I don't know. But that's. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Wouldn't they Once like not be dead though? Up, this place will it be isn't a like fortress. God. mess with their Can brain. You imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore. It's uh, useless without gas. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas easy. So, what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. I don't know, bro. Something about them, I, I don't. We can take this place if we... You know what's crazy? I was thinking that. <laughs> it's two brothers and an old lady. I was... I swear to God, dead ass is thinking that. I'm like, bro, what if we took this? And like, it's ours now, bro. Like, I, I, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. I'm sorry, but like... There's another one. It's just the reality, bro. I see it. So this kills them too? His ass hanging on, bro. <laughs> Gotta cut the hands off. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Ugh. It's rotten hands. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Bro, shut the fuck up, bro. Just try to focus on the task. I don't even know. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Why don't you take a biscuit when they offered it? You still worry about Come them on. damn cheese and I think crackers. I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Uh, push the fence post. But wouldn't we be stuck on this side Holy now? Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh! Uh, I told you what would happen. Oh what hell no! Get to the gate. Who the fuck is this? Now nah, we gotta go behind this tractor. Jesus. We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Oh, fuck these are those other no people idea. he was talking about. Fuck. Now he, remember he said he made deals with other people. Gate is our only way out. You didn't deliver the good. Oh, now we're shit, gonna take uh, I look out, I'm gonna be fucking dead. Bro. Get out of the are stuck in the, the dirt. Tractor. Show yourself. Ooh, Can we like push it now? You there we go. But we can't push it. You assholes. Oh, you there's down. a fucking Try move it, move it, move it. Me. Okay, come on. Right, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's the gate. We can get through we this fence and back to the house. Get ah, they're on the move. Shit, that hurts. Use the tractor to cover. I see ya. No, you don't see me. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> hey, stay down, bro. Stay down. <sighs> what happened? Shit! It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move. It. I already got one of you. Can we? Damn it! It feels like yeah, he's gonna be heavy. Oh, we did it. <sighs> well, these dudes are trash, though. Why don't they just run up on us? Obviously, if we had weapons, we would have shot back by now. Another one? 
How many of those things you did you push down? Well, imagine. I feel like one of these are gonna wake up, bro, because that fence doesn't kill them. This is. A, yeah. See. See. What did I just say? Stop him out. Stop him out. What is fucking dude doing? He's not even helping at all. I don't even know his fucking name. Ooh. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. Right oh, this angle is so bad. I can't tell if I'm behind the, the tractor or not. And this dude is gaining on me. <laughs> bro, please. Kick him. Is, bro, really? What was I supposed to do? I was going as fast as I could. Bro, whatever, bro. I'm going to make us restart from this far back. All right, so we throw him, right? So now we just... Come on. I feel like I'm in front of the. Right I am in front of it. So what do I do? He's gonna fucking catch me. Maybe not. Maybe I was just too far back. Yeah. All right, we're good. Let's get out of here. They just left the gate wide open. We ain't going nowhere. We ain't going nowhere. <laughs> If I don't get a life, bro. Lee, what's wrong? What do you mean what's wrong? You turned the fucking uh, fence on. Uh, the electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Hell I on. heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord. What Which one is Mark? Is Mark this guy? What did he yell? Woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hey y'all. Mark. Oh, oh my god. Oh, that is Mark. When what did Mark happened? yell? He He's lying. An arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is here. this? We ran into some people oh, here he go. Just got something to Bandits, complain about. I, guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. We thought it was. So much for your understanding. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor end. That's very true. Listen, Come on, we may have had this is our best like chance people, at food. But we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Oh shit. Bandits? Are you serious? Oh, we about to get this get place back? This isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. I'm sorry. I'm actually going to have to agree with Kenny this time. find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Come on! Oh, talking Kenny just like me! There, Rambo. Yeah, Kenny. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. Oh, now, oh, now it's don't get... Throwing out before we eat. Yeah, whatever. I make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Ew. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Ah, okay. Makes sense. She probably was smashing them biscuits. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my tree house. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the That's swing? Huh? Yeah. I got that cheese and cracker Anytime. energy. We're looking out for you. I'm telling you, something about... I, oh, this is just too good, though. Too good. You said come see him when we want to, like, get our get back, right? Let's, uh, let's actually talk to Clem, though. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah. It's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Oh, for sure. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. 
Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Don't fucking say that shit all. Man, man. You was already swinging, bro. We get a turn. Um, what do you think of the dairy? What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, yeah it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm gonna be honest, bro. I'm gonna say I'm not sure. I'm, not I'm sure, really Clint. not sure. I hope so. I hope so too. Let's ask her how she's doing. Cause don't forget, like this whole time, still she thinking like my Duke's pops, like they're gonna pop up at some point. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah, he just got Are shot in the shoulder. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck. So don't worry. <laughs> okay. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened. No, we're about to go uh, make sure that don't happen. Promise? I promise. All right, Clint. That's enough for now. Okay, thanks for pushing me. Of course, it's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. <laughs> Damn, he pushing him hard as hell. Actually, I want to talk to Kenny. Can I talk to Kenny? I want to make sure like we're on the same page because he said take this shit over if we have to. And I'm, yeah, that's how I'm feeling too. Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Is it? How you holding up? The lead doesn't want to be here. Your family made it here. Actually, I don't care. What the fuck? Around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits. Now that's exactly where I'm going right now, bro. Right. Don't even worry about it. I'll see what I can find out. Yeah, I, I wanted to talk to Kenny, but then I looked at the options and it's like, I don't care about none of that. I don't care how your family made it over here and like, I don't know. Well, comment below what's your opinion on Kenny. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. Yeah, you definitely should have. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Two of us? Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah, but like, why do I have to do it? Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. I don't know if I trust this dude. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I, I got will. you, bro. I ain't worried about luck. It's skill out here. You see how I'm one hand in this rifle? That's kind of crazy, bro. That rifle got to be kind of heavy. He just swinging that bitch like it's nothing. See anything? I'm not walking not in yet. front of him with the gun. Nope, nope, nope. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. Here. They found the camp? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. You found it? Should we just like kind of wait for them to come back or something? Sneak up to the camp. Right. You see anybody? Uh, I'm just say stay on your guard. Stay on your guard. 
Because it does look empty, but I don't want him to just be like, oh, it's whatever. Oh, Watch okay. Well, back, that's fine. I'm going to check out the tent. Well, let's just walk in here. Someone could be in there sleeping, though, because it is closed. So they had to close it from the inside. Oh. Oh, that looks like a little kid's blanket. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Alright. Let's see what's going on in here. We got anything valuable? Nothing. Empty. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. See, that's what I was thinking too about like the kids winking thing, but at the same time, that could probably mean nothing because in the apocalypse, you just grab whatever you can grab. So that could very well just be an adult on a kid's winking or something. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days, they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need empty cans, too much for one person. We don't know whose camp this we is. We don't know whose camp this is. Might not be bandits. It must be. They don't share their neighborhood. Oh, uh, yeah, true. True, true, true. Oh! Found something. Boxes from the dairy here. It's gotta be bandits. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. They got their own branded boxes. Is that a walkie? What was that? What was a camera? What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's good. see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. See, this what the fuck I'm talking about, bro. I'm telling y'all, bro, these niggas are up to something. He took note of the fact that I said that we run it, like, together. And then now, the fact that I said, oh, she has us on a schedule. I, oh, well, you said that it was a democracy. Like, bro, if you don't fucking relax, it's not that serious. And then the other thing I picked up on, he said... We said that the camera or whatever, right? He's like, let me see that instantly. Whenever like we said we find a camera, let me see that. And then <laughs> he's like, Lee's like, hey, the battery's dead. Okay, good. What do you mean good? Why is that good that the battery's dead, bro? I'm not stupid. I'm picking up on y'all BS. Like, I don't know what could be on that camera, but I mean, obviously you don't want us to see. A lot of stuff. Stop asking me about like our camp, bro. That don't even really matter anymore. Is it still hot? Just water. It's just water. Ish. Oh, yeah, is that a gas can? Gas can? Gas can? Nothing but fumes. Shit. Shit, what else do you want me to look at here? A chair? Looks like they expected to be here a while. Yeah, I think I done looked at everything over here. I look in the tent, you know? Oh, I never looked in the tent myself. I don't think. Yeah, I never looked in the tent. Oh, man. Yeah, this has to be a kid. Unless, like, it's just another big 
<laughs> like, I don't use the stuffed animal as a pillow. Up in this. Was more like. Oh! The hell? Oh! That's Clem's hat! Put your guns down. Oh no! I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What oh, the so fuck you, happened? Knew, you know her. You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. Say, who are you? You people broke it first. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> you laughing for It's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's Lee, a, you just hell of a lot people? safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. No, you're talking me. crazy. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. Where did you get Stop that hat, bro? You. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? Are you Clem's mom? No. What the hell are you talking about? That's not Clem's mom. You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. <laughs> yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. The then I'm gonna head down to that farm about? and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter crazy, what happens, bro. one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Who is they? Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. For oh. Us. Oh my God. Why did he shoot her? God damn it! You murdered that woman. I'm just going to shoot her myself. Thanks. Like I'm not going to say no. I don't want to. I'm just not going to say anything. You notice your side. Whoa! I I don't know what else to say. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. How the fuck? That's good shooting right there. What? Are you serious? Yeah. What a waste. So, you really just say it. that? We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. That's the thing, though. She was saying a lot of shit, bro. She was like, yo, I know what you do up there. I, uh... Um... I don't, she was just saying stuff, and it seemed like he yeah, didn't want her to say too much. Say, see this, she said she knew him too. Message. Can we at least take her crossbow. Oh, thank you. Come on. We got Clem's hat, right? I don't know, because like the reason why I didn't want to say like he murdered that woman is because at the end of the day, it was a standoff. And at some point, it was going to be like her or us. And they even gave us the option to shoot her. So. Oh, Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. I don't even think You're it was back. her, though. What happened? Handled it, Mama. Handled it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Who's Terry? Terry. My husband. Uh. Miss him every day. What happened? Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. Oh, yeah, I'll do it myself. I'm hungry. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? A lot of tension with y'all. Yeah, you can say that. Don't mind them. It's how they are. Uh, don't mind them, it's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all did a little Yeah, that's passing. definitely part of it, we'll for sure. Shortly. Yes, ma'am. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. 
I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. What's up with that food, though? That's that's what I'm going to have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know Bad. it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cat. Oh, nice. That woman is a lifesaver. Hell yeah. You know whatever she about to cook about to be good as hell too, cause the big women like, they, yeah, she got like like the lunch lady elbows, bro. You know she about to whip up some shit. Oh yeah, let's go give it to Clem. Can we go over? Okay, we gotta go to the fence first. Let's go talk to them, see what's going on with them. Why like Kenny and her were arguing, and then, yeah, give Clem her hat and shit. See what's going on with the cow. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Any shots? Some yeah, I'm straight up to found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow. So Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? I don't, I don't even know. Yeah, she I think she was trying to tell me something. But then he just went off. I don't like So she was thing. trying to say something. All I right. still say we should go back to the motor inn where we at least know what to expect. Can we at least get dinner, bro? What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here. See, we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we are. I don't know, are. bro. I kind of agree with I Kenny, it, though. We just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I, I don't know, bro. So. I'm starting to agree with Kenny, nosy. though. Cause, like, These kinds of people are usually pretty protective the of their lady, privacy. Yeah. The questions. There's just too many things pointing to the fact that they like up to something. Us thrown out in our asses. I don't care what you have to say, old man. You're racist. Alright, we talked to them. I don't know where Kenny's at. He might be in here, actually. But let's go in here, see what's going on with the cow. Give Clemmer a hat. And if Kenny's in here, we'll talk to him, too. He is not in here. Okay. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. I wonder if cows can get infected. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. Oh, she was just we'll pregnant. We'll see, Clementine. What is that, a cow What's look? this thing? Salt lick. Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> Hell no. You're funny, Clem. Hey, take the hat, though. Take the hat, though. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. No, no, no. The hat, though. Here, Clementine. I'm still confused on how the lady got the hat. My hat! You found it! Can we question Clem right now? I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Are you lying? Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Nah, okay, she had to I have will. came in the Baby, motor inn or something. Do you think you'll ever have kids? Uh, let's just say I'd like to someday. I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Appreciate well, that, Clem. Thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Uh, let's talk to Andy. So we hey there, on, Andy. Right? Yeah. Yeah? The fuck? We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh... He probably talks a little more than he ought to. Hmm. How's the cow? Mm. Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Okay. Thanks. I'm not going to ask when, yep. when uh, we might eat, because that just seems very, like, you know. A little lock on this door. You found it too, huh? Oh, look, it's Kenny. 
Lee, they're hiding something. Behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. Uh, it's not a job to be paranoid, Lee. That's the thing. Just because they have a a, a a door that's locked doesn't necessarily mean like they're hiding something. And there's boxes and something sharp. Like, uh, don't get me wrong. Am I suspicious? Yes, but not just because of that. Like, I could, like, I don't know. It could be a tool. I got my whole family on this farm right now. I don't know. How about you? What about Clem? She's not actually family. Ah, I, I would not say, bro. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. Oh. I definitely heard a noise. Okay, he didn't say that. What? My point is, he we didn't say that. Okay, sure. that's different. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Can we just oh, do man, this after this dinner, thing. though, bro? You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. That's what I'm saying. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. I say we do this after dinner. I'm still down to do it, just after dinner. We got screws and we got a lock. We can take the screws off. Hey, good. Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. What? Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban. What the? Huh? You are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out. Nah, of that's wild. Nah, nah, bro. I lost a little bit of respect for Kenny after that one. What? What See the those fuck? Screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. This nigga Kenny inside. just said, "Hey, then bro, we'll it all again you like can pick a lock. Around. You a nigga, right? All like, right. bro, like you what? Play. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow, Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? What? Checking out the barn. What's behind the door? Yeah, let's just straight up ask. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. D don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Nah, Andrew, nah, 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 nah. Again. That just gave it away right no there. No problem. Right away, Doc. Fucking tools. Get out of here, bro. I know that's what I said, too, but you don't lock tools up. I mean, I know what he said. Nah, 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 nah. I gave it away. Distract Andy to get him out of the barn. Why can't the fuck am I supposed to distract him to get, him, get him out of the barn? Obviously, you got to do something out of the barn to get him out of the barn. Right? Can I leave the barn? Oh. Oh. <laughs> so, Whoa. how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, what are you doing? Just fine. Plus, <laughs> I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. All right, then, Larry, for sure. Look at the generator. Use it. I can use it. Oh, maybe turning it off would, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe that'll distract him. Hey, back up. Get, get away, get away, get away. Yep, here he come. Damn, he heard that shit instantly. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. That's it? Is that enough time to distract him? All right, let's go see if, if that was enough. Let's see if Kenny did anything. I doubt it. Like, that was really quick. Like, he came out real quick and just turned it back on. And, no. Looks like Kenny did nothing. Because Kenny sucks. How do I distract Andy? Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Cool. Thanks, bro. Can't get that lock off the door. I still can't get that lock off the door. Hmm. You probably just need a screwdriver or something. No shit, bro. He is not helping at all, bro. Let's see if there's a screwdriver in any of these stalls. I want to play in the hay. Can you, Let's like... Stay close to your mom for now. Get away from me. Okay. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh -uh. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, yeah. smells pretty foul. Old dirty clothes. And it stink. 
Are they in a wheelbarrow? Alright, there's nothing in here. And Kenny ain't helping at all, so let's go look somewhere else. Oh, you know what? Over here, the toolbox. Duh. Come on, man. Hey, real quick in the comments, bro. How do y'all prefer? Like, do y'all like to just have all of one episode in a video? Or uh, would y'all rather just be like two episodes or two videos an episode? Because I know this is probably going to be like mad long because right now I've been recording for like an hour and a half. And I don't even know how close we're be, we are to being done. So like, would it be easier to just split them up into twos or? Yeah. Power just turning switch. the switch off again ain't going to do it. This got to be something else. Can we like can look at it? Oh, aha. Why is he not running out here, though? This time? There you go. Use a multi tool on it. All right. Yeah, that should do it. He, if he's not an idiot, he would know that someone just took the belt off. Fucking Danny, where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Oh, son of a okay, so he knows fuck. the belt's gone. Oh, this take forever. Okay. Bet. Now's our chance. Now's our chance. Run, Lee! Please! Stop fucking walking! Alright, now's my chance. I have a multi-tool. Like, yes. Right over here. Now, I don't think this is a good idea. Because he, like, he's just going to walk back in. Wait, is that the dinner bell? You see Clem face like, we got to eat. <laughs> okay, honey, let's get that. Dad, dad, come on, let's eat. Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on, don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Kenny, why don't you do it? Why does, man. Uh, I have no respect for Kenny, y'all. And then he, he pretty much called me a nigger, so like, nah. Nah, 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 nah. One, two, bow. Oh. All right. What do we think's back here, y'all? Oh, oh, they be doing surgery back here. Ooh, the bear trap was theirs. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Oh fuck. Dinner time. Why is he smiling like that, bro? I'm just gonna say, what the hell is this? What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you so see, why is this so creepy? To worry I mean, he does about. have like a pig sign up there and shit. No, that's not a cow. I thought he was about to murk me, bro. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, oh, oh Brenda, biscuits? you wow. are an angel. I know them biscuits fire. Oh, excuse me. We had them to biscuits lock the back door hell. after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago. Where the fuck is um? Inside since. Mark Everybody, it. sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh. Oh yeah, I was an arrow on his shoulder, bro. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Yeah. Th hey. Now don't you worry about it. Thank you. Me. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rip. Bro, it's a fucking arrow in the shoulder. It's not that big of a deal. First. Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. She said it's she says upstairs? What'd she say? Scratches. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Can I go up oh no, I'm not supposed to go up the stairs. Cause here's the actual sink. I'm gonna go up the stairs. Okay, we're sneaking upstairs. Apparently, this is where Mark is at, bro. All he has is a fucking arrow in the shoulder, bro. No, I'm not acting like that. Ooh, I'm not acting like that's not like something. It's definitely something. But he can come down here and eat. Open the closet. There's nothing too crazy. Morphine. 
Is it morphine? Well, they need so much morphine for Morphine is what you use to put people to sleep, right? A towel? Isn't Most that like morphine? You do the thing and uh, hold on, bro. <laughs> hold on, bro. Hold on. I told you they're back there doing surgery. What did I say? Bro, are we just in there? Oh, blood stains. Is that blood? We in the house. Where the hell is Mark? I thought Brenda said he was up here resting. She fucking lying. They killed him. What's going on? Go to the bookshelf. Uh, farm books, cookbooks. There's scratches on the oh, ground right there. Here. In the bookshelf. I think you might be able to move it. Right? Am I tripping? Y'all see that, right? This wire, though. What is this wire? Is that something? Power cord. <sighs> Where's that cord going? Can we connect it? Yeah. What the hell? Ah, I was right. Behind, right behind this, behind the bookshelf. Remember there were scratches right there. No, 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 no. See if we can move it now. They gotta hear that. They gotta hear that. At this point, they're coming up here. And and we've been up here for a minute washing our hands, so uh, we better find some sort of discovery back here. Cause if not, it's a wrap. I knew they killed him. They killed him. They killed. Oh, Please. oh, they didn't kill him. They fucking cut his legs off. What the hell happened? Oh, uh, brothers. What happened to your legs, man? Oh. Don't eat dinner. Oh! They served Mark up. They served that nigga up. Barbecue? Nah, that's crazy. They served him up. Bro, run. Bro, scream. Lee, do something, bro. Fuck, I was hungry, too. No, no that's Mark dies. Clementine, no. Don't eat that, don't eat that, don't eat don't that. Don't eat that! Uh, huh? That's Mark fucking... Lee, Jesus, man. Mark you hamstrings, bro. Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Shut Lee. The hey, no, go ahead and eat that. Oh, Doug going crazy. They could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs legless. You're eating human meat. It didn't have to be this way. You know, it's, You're it's true. human meat. Yep. That's crazy. What the hell? Ridiculous. Okay. I'm scaring the kids, Lee. I'm not fucking Lee, playing, what bro. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm Dug dead ass, dungeon, bro. Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Eat, what is going bro. on? Go upstairs and look. He You'll find a guy with shit. both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. That's true. A dairy, they wouldn't have meat. That's very That's trying to even think about that. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We got to think about living. We had an arrow in the shoulder. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. And they just eat him, bro. How I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. You're all sick. Yeah, you are fucking sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. I'm not implying. I'm straight up telling you. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyway. Mark had an arrow in the shoulder. What's she talking about? Like y'all. Can you get your gun? Can he get your gun? Can he? No. Nobody's mean, going no. anywhere. Oh, shit. Oh, we got shit. lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? Yeah, set the fuck down. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of here! Don't go near my fucking Mommy, family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Just don't say anything. There's, don't, there's no- Hey! <gasps> oh, no! Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Mmm, there's not really much we can do right here, Lee. Is that fucking Mark? He crawl downstairs or something? That's definitely Mark. Please. Someone. Ah. Oh. 
kids don't need to see this, bro. Coming up. Oh, shit. Right in the jaw. Open the goddamn door. You can't keep us in here. throwing up. Open up. I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bang. bare hands. We gotta find another way out of here. She probably ate some. Oh, they was in there yeah, smashing too. Uh, fucking duck. He was going crazy. Like, mm, mm. I was eating that. Oh my god. The goddamn we got door down. Stop. At least we stopped Clem from eating. It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us good did. Shit, damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet. Come on, Dad. Now's not oh, the see, time. Oh, see. I was so sick of this dude. Now all of a sudden, it's if you didn't drag your feet and like, oh my god. Let's ask Clem. Okay, okay. They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up, Lee. Those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought thumb us sucker? here. You all just shut the fuck up. I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. God. Uh, air conditioner. Hmm. Do we still have our multi tool? Uh, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, oh shit, his heart condition. Oh god. Dad? You don't know how to fucking relax, bro. No. Dad, come on. That's his girl. That's his God. fault. He just like he relax. Breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. Oh. oh no. What has to happen, Lee? If he's think dead, he's going to come back. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Nah, Not he's you. right, bro. We can he's bring him big back. as shit, too. Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it! Oh, and Clem's just sitting he's here. not dead. We can't kill him if he's not dead. Maybe you're right. We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. You remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. That's true, bro. Him Kenny's making good points, but I'm not at the like, drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same. True, now. true, 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 true. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make. How do we know that? You haven't even checked this pulse or anything. Said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. Shut the fuck. I'm so sick God of you always it, talking I about having you. your back, bro. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. I'm sorry, y'all. I gotta help Lily here, bro. Fuck. Is he breathing at all? No. No. Because, like, for real, bro. It, like, the, we don't know for sure the dude is dead. And just to be on fucking Kenny's side and be like, yeah, we gotta do this nigga in, bro, with, without even doing our due diligence. Like, nah, that's not right. He, can, The fact that he even thinks that, like, we should do that is not cool. I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn. What? You're putting all of us at risk, you son of Three, a bitch! You're four, fucking worthless, Lee. Fuck! Oh! No! Kenny, I'm sorry. what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, oh I do, my Lee. fucking so god, he smashed that nigga's you, head man. in. Shut up, bro. Oh my gosh. I'm so over this dude, Kenny, with like the whole like, oh, I need you on my side. I need you on my side. I need you on my side. Like, bro, what is up with you? Like, do you have like a crush on us or something? Like, what the fuck is going on, bro? Like, that don't even make sense for us to even like to sit there and do that. And then for you to just smash his head in right in front of his daughter right there while she's doing CPR. It's crazy, bro. Like, I, like, bro, I don't know. I don't like Kenny, y'all. I don't like her. I know. Don't you fucking touch me. <laughs> In front of fucking Clem, so she saw that shit. Are you okay? Is it over? She's seen some crazy stuff, bro. Yes, for now. His head is smashed we in. We still need to find a way out of here. 
No, I'm sorry. That's not cool, Kimmy. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? Leave that. I, I don't know, bro. Your walkie-talkie. How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. Like, Lee, you gotta understand. Like, she just saw a whole, like, murder, bro. I'm working on it. That is fucking gross. Do I even talk to... Should I try to talk to her? Ah. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Let's just say Larry was Sorry, a good father. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so He great, has all his blood he on her mouth and shit. To protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> Damn, that is fucking gross, bro. Anyways, what's, should we talk to... Man, he gonna get mad, bro. You're supposed to have my back, Lee. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. Shut the fuck up, bro. Could you kill Katja or Duck? Why would I say, I don't know about saying that. I'm just going to say what now. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. I I don't know. Asking him if he could kill Katya or Duck does not. Speaking of Katya and Duck, where the fuck are they? Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. We still got it. Of course they took it. Yeah. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh uh. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. So we need like some sort of like coin or something. Something like flat. Can we ask it really if she has a coin? Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. Oh, he probably has a coin. I think I may have found a way out of here. I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What Damn. about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. Did he? What do you want? Oh, you My remember blessing that? to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Uh, appreciate you, I guess. Oh boy, that is fuck. Uh, ah, that is any gross. idea which pocket he keeps his change in. That is gross. Here we go. Here we got it. Two quarters and a dime. All right, let's do this. Yeah, again, let me know how y'all feel about us um doing these in like two parts cuz they are kind of long. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Shut the fuck up, Kenny. Bitch. Oh. Probably gonna have to have Clem go up there. Here's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. Let's hope she's safe. I know you're brave I enough. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Oh, you Remember got it. the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let's go. All right, she's locked in. She's ready okay. to go. Gas her up a little bit. All right. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Damn, 
Oh, this was a crazy episode, bro. Why she scream? Oh. Where the hell are you going? What do you care? Oh, get Kenny. the fuck out of here, Kenny. You are such a bitch, bro. I can't Lady, stand that nigga. I'm man. sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Hey, we're good. Okay? Oh, bet. Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Hopefully his family's good, though, you know? At the end of the day, I don't fuck with Kenny, but hopefully uh, his wife and kid are good. I told you there was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. That is gross. I think that, yeah, they're actually doing, like, human body parts in there. Or make sure we get some weapons just in case you never know I don't want to look at any of that but I'll take that yeah take everything we can get I'm not trying to look at oh no we got a one or the other fuck it oh that's why she said there's a man outside okay here we go oh, I got to talk to fucking Kenny what the hell do you think you're doing Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. All right, now he's not even thinking at all, bro. Oh, there's a sickle. I'm pretty sure it's like one or the other. I'm gonna keep this because it seems like it can like immobilize them. Look, Kenny. Who wants some? I dare some dead asshole to try cross my fence tonight. Look, Kenny. I know we don't agree with each other and shit right now, but in hey, order to survive. What are you doing outside the barn? Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Well, sitting out in the rain like a damn weird. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. One to keep? Why would you keep I one can't. alive? Oh, trading. So that's what they be doing. Oh, I know, Mabel. This is hey, my favorite. Keep your eye too. on. Keep my eye on. Where? One oh. think they can just walk right out. <laughs> they never even look down. Can you see? Yeah, I saw him. Nothing, bro. I just keep looking? I don't want to get caught. Oh, shit! Grab it! Taze him! Oh, that shit didn't work. Oh, my God. I chose the wrong weapon. Kenny! Kenny! You bitch! Let's go, Lily! Kenny's a bitch, bro. He wasn't going to... Oh, official Kenny. All right, no, nah, I'll remember that. I will remember that. Hell yeah. Don't look at me like... Yeah, nah. That's cool, Kenny. No! That's cool. That is cool. Yeah, go run to your fucking family, bitch. Hopefully they're all right. This shit, Lily. Oh. <laughs> See, you understand now, don't you? You can have me. I don't think it's how the world works now. Get part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Cannibalism? Like, ugh. That's why you killed that woman. Mark never volunteered to be food. That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill yeah. everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. So, uh, so she did not. Okay. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, 
The meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already what tainted. The fuck you ew. ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. Okay, here's the thing, bro. Alright, so do we kill this dude, bro? Uh, uh part of me wants to kill him because it's like Fuck you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Fuck you, but I'm trying to think of like the negatives that will come with killing him. Niggas look at me as a murderer now. I'm, I've already, I got a body under my uh, belt already, but like most people don't know about it. But I feel like this is a murder that would be justified. People wouldn't care. But why is this such a big decision? Like, why are they like, you know? I, I'm not gonna, y'all gonna call me a bitch. I'm not gonna kill him, bro. Fuck. This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you! Yeah! That's what he wanted. We don't give him what he wants. Oh, Clem probably would have saw. Clem probably would have saw. Okay, I think I did good, y'all. I did good, I did good. Okay, I did good. I did good. Go. Let's go, man. I'll cover you. This shit, I'll fuck you, really. Keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back. Man, when I'm given the chance, I'm bending Lily over, bro. Where the fuck is Kenny? Stupid ass. Kenny! Kenny gonna get me fucking killed, bro. In the house. Who's that? Is that Kenny? No, no, from the, from, uh, what's her name? Yeah. I forgot Sorry. about them. And then Ben. Me? Ow. Yeah. Shh. They're probably worried about what the fuck's okay? going on. You guys have been gone way too long. We need your help. We need your help. Yeah, when you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Shit. Bro, imagine is hearing that. Okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Good show, bro. Yeah, Carly a real one, too. I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. The fact that she trusts Ben, though. That was kind of stupid of us to, like, send her and Ben back, like, to watch the fucking thing. Because we, we barely know Ben. We kind of set Carly up, like, with that. This nigga Ben could have, like, I don't know, bro. Brought homies over or something. What? All right, we go up to the house. Where is Kenny at, bro? Oh, uh, I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Kenny should be in there saving his family. It shouldn't be up to me. Andy, Danny, is that you? Oh shit! What's going on out there? Do I just sit here? I'm not gonna say nothing. Oh god. She's frightened by the lack of response. Fuck. But if I would have said, yeah, it's me, she would have known it's not my voice or his voice. Lee, hit back. Don't come Oh in my here. gosh. Let her go, Brenda. Did we fuck up by, like, not saying anything? What do I do? Oh. Open the door. Please. Surprised she doesn't Please, just shoot. Don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Now where is Kenny at, bro? This is your Stop family. Right there, I mean it. Put the gun down, bitch. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> what you do? I'm not gonna do all that. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Oh, it's a walker behind her. Is it? Is that Mark? It's gotta be Mark, right? Probably passed. Keep backing up. Stay back! Don't do anything! Uh, I'm not gonna do nothing. Just keep backing up. Let go. Let her go, Brenda. Please listen to him. I'll do it. Please. No, you won't. Where is, bro? I keep saying it, but where is Kenny, bro? I don't want to kill you, Lee. Hey, it's cool. Like we don't have to do. It. Why would I say Please any of these lines, bro? <laughs> Just stop. One more step. 
One more step. Come on, one more step. Oh, oh got her. Good oh. shit, Mark. Doc, where's Kenny? I said, don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurt him. Oh my god. Oh, okay, he found a. Uh, he found a duck. Oh. oh shit. That ain't gonna happen. Andy, don't shut up. Oh, oh Kenny, what are you doing? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Andy. Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. What for, huh? All we wanted was some goddamn gas. No, you wanted some fucking human dick or I don't what? know. You wanted some meat. Good shit. What's her name? Oh shit. I don't even remember. Oh, Carly, Carly, Carly. Oh shit, oh shit! Remember he said the fence was sharp? Oh my god! Can somebody help me? Oh no, he's not doing what I think he's doing. Get up! Get the fuck up! Somebody grab the damn gun! Can somebody help? Bro, this is insane, bro. Everyone's just watching. Gotcha. Grab the gun. Somebody, bro. My Q finger getting tired. <laughs> Somebody help. Lily. Come on, Lily. Imagine if, bro. Imagine if we didn't, like, help her. Would she have just let us die? Bitch. Bitch. Let me get a left. Yeah, right. Yeah. Whoop his fucking ass, Lee. Whoop that fucking ass, Lee. Shit, we still going? Damn. We got his arms pinned, too. Bitch. Yeah, we fucked him up. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit. Bro, shut the fuck up, because I can really do you like that. It's over! Fuck you! As soon as Danny and Mama get out here, you, you all fucked! Uh, yeah, I don't know how to tell you Mama's done. They're both dead. They're not coming. I said it's over. They're both dead. They're both dead. What did you do? No, they're not even both what dead, though. What the fuck did you do? They're really both not dead. Only Mama is dead. I don't know why I said that. Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Shut the fuck up, bro. Get back here and finish this, Lee! Finish this? You want me to kill you? Kick him? I don't know if I kick him, it's probably gonna kick him into the fence, bro. Just walk away. Right, Cause you know, that's what they want. They want us to do that, bro. They want us to kill them. They want us to do it in front of uh, like man, the mentoring. Like, nah, bro, we're not doing that. Nah, bro. I'm not giving y'all what y'all want. They're getting in. Oh shit, the generator went down. Oh! All of my damn name. There go Ma! <laughs> yeah, go eat your son, you fucking carnivore, bro. God damn. Nah, but dude didn't even but the brother didn't die. Unless like he should have stuck in the bear trap and he got eaten by walkers or something, but we didn't kill that brother. Yeah, bro, this is a crazy episode. Crazy, crazy. We did the right thing, bro. We didn't kill anybody in front of Clementine. Hey, Lee. Like, I don't I'd know. Say I think I'm we did right. I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Good shit, Were Carly. They really killing people for food? Hell yeah. He and Clementine almost yeah. ate some. She and did Clementine it. Clementine almost ate some. But 
I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. What was it? Oh, the camera. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What's I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. I wonder what's on that camera, bro. We need, like, a battery. Ah. <sighs> Oh yeah, how's uh how Kenny? Doing? He got shot. I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Didn't he get shot? Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. Fuck you, Kenny. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah. I would imagine so. What do you think? You murdered Larry, you destroyed this group, you're no hero. I'm just not gonna say nothing. Fine then. Fine. I saved Duck on the farm and didn't save Sean. Now I kill someone before I can put your little girl in danger, and I'm even more of a monster. I didn't say any of that. I don't care. You do what you have to do. I'm gonna keep doing what needs to be done. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? Yep, but I didn't kill them. No, they're alive and suffering. We didn't kill them, so I don't know. Yeah, Walker's probably got them. Yes, Walker's probably got them. They were very bad people, and they were punished for it. Okay. We always got to be direct hey, with Clementine. Dad, we're not going to uh, what's that noise? Uh, sugarcoat anything with her. It's going to be straight up. Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Yeah, like a car, like if you leave the door open. Hello? Approach the car slowly. Damn, bro, it's always something going on, bro. I thought this episode was about to end. Figures. Okay, so oh, it was crap. just like a car just here. Baby, you gotta see this. A shitload of food and supplies back here. Oh shit! What? Remember, we didn't get to eat. The only people who got to eat was Carly and Ben because they were eating this all the biscuits food and could shit. Could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, My duck looking like that. You don't that. know if these people are dead. Well, they, if they left. Come it. back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Oh Dad, my God. whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. Well, what if it's ah! not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone? These kids gotta realize, bro. This ain't the. This ain't that no more, bro. We are in an apocalypse. So like, it's every man for the. You saw they was out there eating people, bro. And this car is just like abandoned. Somebody did just leave it. Like, why would they just leave it in like whatever, bro? Like, I'm trying to do the right thing for them, but they also got to realize like times is different, bro. You have to take this. You're right. We shouldn't take this. Why is it always up to me, man? So Kenny's saying take it. And I, oh my God, if we don't agree with Kenny, he's going to throw another fucking bitch fit. Kenny's saying take it. Kasha's saying take it. I think Lily's saying no. And then the kids are saying no. That's all I know. Low key, like I feel like we gotta take this because we're hungry. If this was like a real game and like hunger really mattered, I think I would take this. Like if, if hunger really fucking mattered, bro. And like we were gonna die right now because our hunger meter was low, I think I would take it. But I feel like if we don't take this, there's still gonna be a chance that we find food somewhere else because like it's a game. So like, yeah. Cause I'm scared that if we end up taking it, something bad's gonna happen, bro. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take did this you? stuff. Did you? Did the duck? Yeah, he did. 
Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay. Well, what have we um, got in here? I don't think that look, really helped. No food in that box. Only thing that kind of helped is like Clementine and her like morals and stuff, which again, I feel like morals shouldn't like they are very like skewed in the apocalypse. But at the end of the day, our group took this now. So if anybody does come back and say something, it doesn't matter because our group took it, whether we wanted to they do have it or not. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. <laughs> now all of a sudden everybody's happy to be taking it. I thought I thought a couple of people didn't want to take it. Yeah, I got it. Whatever, bro. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. Nope, she don't want it. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? Oh, so we'll take the batteries. You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, yeah, because she fucked up the batteries in there. <laughs> oh, God. Lee, you're gonna want to see this. Oh, shit. What's on there? Don't do this, bro. Don't, no. Sh show us. All oh, people were watching us. People were watching us. It was that lady, right? The crazy lady? Oh. Oh, darling, baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. What the? F we won't let them bandits get you. We're talking Clementine. Okay. What kind okay. of camera is this? I don't know. You can pick can up you fucking help me sound find like it? that. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll safe. let you know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. Of. She's right, though. To call friends. People. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. So I don't. I don't entirely get what was like. So they stopped getting food from the dairy. I don't entirely get what was going on with that camera situation right there. I'm not going to lie. It didn't seem like that big of a deal. It just seemed like she was watching us. Chop David's leg off. You and 44% of uh, players chopped his leg off. I mean, what was the other option? Like, just to fucking sit there? Interrogation shot Jolene. You and 61% of players had Danny Shooter. Yeah, that makes sense. Because, like, yeah, that just makes sense. Helped kill Larry. You and 51% of players didn't help. So you telling me it was damn near a 50-50 split of people killing Larry? It's probably because they just didn't like him. And like, I don't really blame him because like he is a dickhead. So like, yeah. You and 61% of players didn't kill both brothers. Nice. Let's go. All right. See, I think I'm doing like, you know, the right thing. And then stole the food. You and 49% of players didn't steal. I, I hope that comes back to help us somehow. We get good karma out of that because I feel like we sold. But at the end of the day, like I said, it's a video game. So like we're gonna be fine like we're gonna have food but they also said something about clementine in a jacket so i don't know maybe that will come into play at some point but yeah this episode was crazy bro this episode is actually insane again comment below how you feel about us splitting these up into twos i know y'all are probably gonna be like yeah i'd rather just have it all but um it's, it's probably better for me and for more floats so to cut them up i don't know well I'll, I'll talk to him and see how he wants to do it too but that would mean that like Y'all would essentially, if I can get y'all like, the goal is to get y'all like two uh, Walking Dead videos a week. So that means we get an episode done a week. So pretty much every month we'd be done with the season. I feel like that'd be like solid. So we'll see. But love y'all so much if you made it this far. Make sure you hit the like button, please. Comment below. Uh, If you made it this far, comment below. But what, what should we comment, bro? I don't know. Tell me to comment something, bro. Comment down below that. And uh, I'll catch y'all the next one, bro. Peace. Bone. Screw it.
Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. What the f- Is this all Bro. you got? I told you this town is tapped. Mm. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? There is we a chance for Kenny to, to get got. I'm letting him, about bro. the farm last night. Not much phases anymore. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. Oh! Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit okay, figured you out. People? Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, alright? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Alright, so we are about to hop on the road in this next episode. This seems like some crazy shit about to happen. So, with that being said, take care, and we'll see you tomorrow.